Good morning. It's your boy, Jake Goebel, back at it again. Last day, final trip. Oh, I'm back at it for Orange Cactus Coffee. Sorry. Day 24, Colombia, Huila, Finca, Samboni, Gesha. That is what we've got. They've saved the best for last. I've got 20 grams of coffee in my Hario V60. I'm going to add 60 grams of water for the bloom phase here. I am going to excavate it because that's the type of dude I am. And then I'm going to drink it on espresso. I did check the flavor notes and I was a little puzzled. Puzzled by Onyx flavor notes. I don't think Onyx watches anyway, so I feel free. I feel very free to be critical, annoying, as, as much as I want because I don't think they're going to watch this anywho. But white flowers like not flour like the powdered stuff that looks like cocaine that you know actually cocaine looks more like sugar but that's beside the point okay not that type of flour but like a floral flower like an like an iris like a tulip what is a white like a daffodil right like a cro daffodils are yellow okay so not daffodils but if it were a white a lily are lilies white? And I, I guess maybe we're... I don't know if there is such a thing as a white flower. Maybe there is. Can you see the steam rising into my face? That's hilarious. Anyways, how is that a flavor note? I don't know. I don't know. I, are we eating them? Are we just sniffing them? I mean, that's a white flower right there. I look on the coffee taster's flavor wheel and I see chamomile, rose, and jasmine. And it's okay, like jasmine, okay, we drink jasmine tea, right? Chamomile, that's a tea. We drink rose. I guess you can drink rose, rose hips. Is it rose hips? I think that's a tea. Rose petals, something along those lines. Those are all teas that you, that you drink. I just don't know if I've ever had a white flower tea. Is that a thing? I don't know, but it doesn't sound like a thing. It doesn't sound like a thing. It just sounds like a made up thing. I guess everything is made up, right? But it sounds like a made up thing instead of a real thing. Let me just get this to 260 or two, I'm at 260. Let me just get this to 300 real quick. I will irritate it, agitate it just a little bit more. Actually, I don't want to do too much of anything to it. Maybe give it a little swirl. There we go. And it's at two and a half minutes. Good. So, yeah, that drawdown, hopefully that turns out pretty nice. Oh, I didn't grab the mugs. Look at that. Are you kidding me? Okay. Hold on. Aubrey, this is the tulip. That's why I wanted to be dramatic with how I presented the mugs. That's what it is. This is the split. No, I totally just forgot. Them. And this is the open. These are Tim Wendell bow mugs. And I like them. I like them a lot. We're after three minutes, so the drawdown is a little longer. That's okay. That's okay. I think we're still going to get a good. It's 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 almost there. Let's get let's get the espresso going though. So flavor notes were supposed to be white flour, honey, and blueberry. We'll see what we get here. There are some subtle floral notes, but I would say overall, a lot of honey. It is very smooth. It is a, a very smooth coffee. It's very nice. The mouthfeel is really nice, but I would say more honey than anything else. But like whatever flower the honey was coming from, like maybe there's a little leftover in there. Like where do they make, I mean, they, all kinds of flowers. Bees, bees don't care. Bees don't discriminate. Bees ain't tripping. Bees are like, oh, it's a flower? Bam, I'm gonna make me some honey out of that. So whatever that flower was that the bees made the honey from, that's what's kind of lingering in there a little bit. Mm, 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 mm. It is nice. Drawdown is okay, maybe a minute long. Maybe not quite as, not exactly what I want here. Let me get that. Let me get that. <laughs> I was trying to not drip everywhere. 
I know. It worked great, didn't it? Okay. I dreamt. Never mind. Here's the open. It's so smooth. You got to try this. But just like the way that it sits in the mouth on the tongue is very smooth. I'm not, I'm not getting any blueberry at all. I am getting honey. And I would probably say jasmine. You know, if I was going to, if I was going to, you know, get slapped around, roughed up on it, I would say honey and jasmine, but delicious coffee. 